Hello! Welcome to Storytime with Miss Chante here at Maynardville Public Library. And today we're going to be reading The Big Pumpkin. And it is by Erica Silverman. And I hope you enjoy this. Big Pumpkin by Erica Silverman. Once there was a witch who wanted to make pumpkin pie, so she planted a pumpkin seed. She weeded and watered, and after a while, a sprout poked through, and then a pumpkin grew, and it grew, and it grew, and then it grew some more. Soon, Halloween was just hours away. The witch thought about pumpkin pie, bent down to take her pumpkin off the vine. That's a big pumpkin. Well, she pulled and she tugged and she pulled. First she pulled hard and then she pulled harder. But that pumpkin just sat. Drats, said the witch. Just then, along came a ghost. Big pumpkin, says the ghost. It's big and it's mine, and it's stuck on the vine, and Halloween's just hours away, said the witch. And she kicked at the pumpkin. I'm a bigger than you, and stronger, too, boasted the ghost. Let me try, <laughs> said the witch. But she thought about pumpkin pie and stepped aside. The ghost bent down to take the pumpkin off the vine while he pulled, and he tugged, and he pulled. First he pulled hard, and then he pulled harder, that pumpkin sat. Drats, said the ghost. Just then, along came a vampire. Big pumpkin, said the vampire. It's big and it's mine, but it's stuck on the vine. And Halloween just airs away, said the witch. And she kicked the pumpkin. I'm bigger than both of you. And stronger, too, boasted the vampire. Let me try. Hmm, said the witch. Hmm, said the ghost. But they thought about pumpkin pie and stepped aside. The vampire bent down to take the pumpkin off the vine. Well, he pulled and he tugged and he pulled. First he pulled hard. And then he pulled harder, but that pumpkin just sat. Drats, said the vampire. Just then, along came a mummy. Big pumpkin, said the mummy. It's big and it's mine, but it's stuck on the vine. And Halloween's just hours away, said the witch. And she kicked the pumpkin. I'm bigger than all of you. And stronger, too, loomed the mummy. Let me try. Hmm, said the witch. Hmm, said the ghost. Hmm, said the vampire. But they thought about pumpkin pie and stepped aside. The mummy bent down to take the pumpkin off the vine. Well, she pulled and she tugged and she pulled. First, she pulled hard and then she pulled harder. But that pumpkin just sat. Drats, said the mummy. Just then, along came a bat. Big pumpkin, said the bat. The witch didn't say a word. She just looked at the ghost and rolled her eyes. The ghost looked at the vampire, 
And the vampire looked at the mummy, and they all looked at the little bat. And they started to laugh. I may not be big, and I may not be strong, said the bat, but I have an idea. And the bat told them what to do. Hmm, said the witch. Hmm, said the ghost. Hmm, said the vampire. Hmm, said the mummy. Ready, set, pull, called the bat. And the bat pulled the mummy. And the mummy pulled the vampire. And the vampire pulled the ghost. And the ghost pulled the witch. And the witch pulled the pumpkin. Well, they pulled and they tugged and they pulled. First they pulled hard and then they pulled harder. And snap off the came the pumpkin. Drat, said the witch. Whoosh! It flew and it flew. And that it landed on top of a hill and thump, thump, thump. Bump, thump, bump. It bounced all the way down to the witch's house. And when it got to her door, that pumpkin just sat. Hooray for the bat, shouted the witch. And she hurried inside to make pumpkin pie. Mmm, said the ghost. Have some more, said the witch. Couldn't eat another bite, said the vampire. Fun party, says the mummy. Time to go, said the bat. Drat, said the witch, as she watched them all leave. And then she went right out and planted another pumpkin seed. Well, I hope you enjoyed the story of the big pumpkin. And now you know if you all work together, you can accomplish big things. Have a great day. Bye.